piece of liquor. PPC Enga Acting Superintendent George Kakas reported that over the last six months, a total of 44 people have been killed and private properties valued at thousands of kina torched and destroyed in five separate tribal fighting instances in Wabek district alone. He said this was bad for the government and donor partners in their efforts in service delivery to the people. He added that all other districts of Anga province remain quiet and peaceful except Wabeg, adding that luckily no public assets such as schools and aid posts were destroyed. The fights in Wabeg were centered at Nandi, where 15 election-related deaths were reported, so past 21 deaths, Ipus, where a policeman was killed and related fighting, resulting in three deaths, Kamas and Teramanda, relating to the killing of the Copen Secondary School principal, a total of three deaths, and Yakananda, two deaths, adding to a total of 44 deaths in six months. The PPC commended Wabeg MP Robert Gani for funding policing efforts and establishing the Peace and Good Order Committee that brokered peace and reconciliation. He also commended the District Law and Order Coordinator and Councillor Soto Pauri, who played a leading role in the reconciliation process. Acting Superintendent Kakas said two men were formally charged and appeared before the Wapek District Court this morning, adding that an ultimatum has been issued to other warring elements to surrender or face the full brunt of the law. Meanwhile, the PPC reported that a liquor ban has seen the confiscation of 2,000 cartons of beer valued at around 300,000 kina. He added that the liquor ban will continue indefinitely until the facilities at the Western Highlands and Enga border is upgraded and fixed. Bernadette Effie, National MTV News.